the pets that we have are... Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. I'm Amy. And I'm Kate. And today's video is gonna be really special because this is a video about what our new pet is going to be and it's really exciting because mm -hmm. like we just got a new pet and yeah, yeah we have right to go now, shopping for it yeah so. so right now we are in Walmart to go looking for some pet supplies mm -hmm. and I'll give you guys one hint of what the pet is but I'm not gonna tell you what the pet is because it's a surprise you'll see in the end of the video but a hint is it's gonna be really definitely weirdly like, like unexpected you know? yeah cuz like it's a pet that not everyone has. Well, uh, uh, don't say uh, Okay, okay. But it's a weirdly unexpected, so let's get started on looking for some supplies. Let's go. <laughs> okay, okay, so. Did you need baby shampoo for the pet? Yeah, because, like, they're babies and they need to smell good, you know? Yeah. Well, I mean. So, all pets need to smell good, but. Yeah, they're not exactly babies, it's just good for the skin. Mm hmm. Well, that's I mean, lotion. Mm, let me see. Oh, lavender. Um, this is what is it? Oh, it's it's lavender bath babies. Mm. But like, isn't purple kind of boring now? Yeah. Maybe this Just one would be good. Like, mm, let's smell it. Ow! <laughs> oh, it's hair and body. Okay, that's oh, yeah, good. that's perfect. Cause the pats, you know, need that. <laughs> the pats. You said pats. I know. Can I? This smell? one smell good. Yeah. Oh, how about oh. this one? This is probably better. Okay, so you finally picked one out. It took forever, but it's yeah. this one. Mm -hmm. um, baby shampoo. I don't know what scent it is, but yeah. This one should be good enough for the pets. Mm -hmm. So let's go look for more stuff. Okay, so what else do they need? I think it'd be good if they had like a bit of hay. Oh, it's, it says what it is. Wait, let me cover it. Okay, that's what it is. Oh. The picture kind of ruins this, so I'm not going to show you guys that. Okay, that's perfect. That. There you go. There you go. Okay, so that's another thing It'd in the cart. It'd be nice to snuggle in and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so there's all the toys. But I don't think the pet needs toys because there's plenty of stuff they can play with, right? Mm -hmm. Wink, wink. So, yeah. Okay. There's some food here. Hmm. The animal we have can eat anything. Yeah, but... except for, like, meat. Except for meat. Okay, so now they're... There needs, sh they need cages. Yeah. Oh, it look, could be a cage or a fish tank. Doesn't really matter. Okay, so, ooh, th no, that, not that one. <laughs> this one's funny. good, but that's mm, not that one. No, we need like, I don't know. Let me see. I don't know. There's so many to choose from. Yeah. So, mm, this is the dog aisle. You don't really need anything here. Hmm, they won't need this, right? Yeah. That's another hint. Oops, I accidentally said it, but it's not a dog. Oh, true. Oopsies. <laughs> I mean, Roxy's enough, so. Yeah, she's enough dog. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we just came back from Walmart and we bought all the supplies that the pets needed. And we bought some, well, we got some critter litter. And then we got some hay. And then some baby shampoo. And hand sanitizer, obviously. Yeah. You know. So here's another hint of what the pet is gonna be. But I want you guys to pause this video right now and comment down below what pet you think it is. So now it's time for the big reveal. The pets that we have are rats! <laughs> I know, it's really weirdly unexpected. Let me move this aside so you guys can see them better. But, hey, tell the story of how you got these pets. Okay, so whenever I started in middle school, my science teacher, she actually was thinking about having a pet, but we'll get rats. And everyone thought it was a pretty decent idea. So we started off the year, they were so tiny. Then they- Now they're so big, like, yeah. mom, at first she didn't like the rest, she was like, Oh, rats no. they're huge but you know what she's getting used to it right yeah and this is I'm gonna tell you guys a very funny story so the first day we got them um, it was time to sleep you know so we made a cage for them well not a cage so it came like in a little backpack and <laughs> she's sleeping on my arm but they came in a little backpack and we let them sleep in the backpack 
And so my dad and mom went to sleep in their room and I went to sleep in my room. So my dad hears some noises like in the middle of the night. Like we have these really, really like wooden floors. You can hear everything. Anything. Everything. Yeah. And, and he so started like, hearing things like. Yeah. And then he wakes up, opens the door and he sees both of the rats outside of their bags. But Maisie, <laughs> she quickly ran back into her um, little like cubby thing. Yeah. And this one she kept on wandering around. So then they woke me up and they're like, hey, there's a rat. And then <laughs> yeah. I easily picked it up and they were like, what? It was that easy to pick it up so mm -hmm. they do listen. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then, okay, so they went back to sleep. They put them in the bathroom in back in their little bags, but this time in their, like, cage they made. So they put them in the bathroom, they went back to sleep, and yeah, that. Mm -hmm. So then my dad hears some more noises mm -hmm. and he goes outside not outside, sorry. <laughs> he goes back into like the living room and bathroom area. He sees the rats outside again, but this, the that time it was only this rat. This one stayed in her cage, but this one got out again. And there's like a little hole in the bathroom, like you know that little hole. She escaped from there. I don't know how. Amy, it's not a door. It's a no. I mean a hole. It's a door crack. It's a door crack. Yeah. So my dad puts her back in the cage. And that. So then he wakes up a third time thinking, you know what, I should make holes and put the cap on it because they're just going to keep escaping. So they made holes in the cage. They put him in the cage. They didn't escape. But that's not the end of the story. <laughs> so my mom thought they were pretty hungry, right? Because they didn't eat that day. She thought this critter litter was food. So what the critter litter does, since they're potty trained already, when they see critter litter, they straight away do their business in critter litter. My mom puts critter litter in the nights inside their cage, thinking it was food. There was then, so much poop. Oh my gosh. It was Yeah, she puts so much critter litter in it, and then I wake up to a horrible smell. I go in the bathroom. They did their business everywhere. Oh and then I ask my mom, why did you put critter litter? She's like, I thought it was food. So that was a funny blooper. They smell pretty weird right now. So we're gonna take them a bath. But yeah, that's it. And now it's time to show you guys what their names are. Her name is Lily. And the, wait, her this one's name was Mouse at first. Yeah, but her name's now Lily. She renamed to hers. And this one is named Maisie. Maisie. And this one's my rat and that one's her rat. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So like I mentioned before, these are potty trained, so like if you put critter litter, they do it straight away. They don't do it on you or anything like that, so they're really nice pets. They're also trained not to bite anyone, like they don't bite anyone, they're really nice. Because they were raised with kids. Yeah. yeah, and they're used to dogs too, like they don't bite dogs or get crazy with dogs or anything. And also, I actually did a research about rats and they're one of the top intelligent creatures like ever known yeah so you got to try like outsmarting them mm -hmm. in a crazy situation like escaping because they're obviously gonna find their way yeah <laughs> they're jumpy okay so right now we are going to take them a bath because first of all no <laughs> they are very smelly and they need a bath and second of all because of the blooper that happened to mom like remember with the litter and stuff and they smell really bad so now they just need a bath God. with the baby shampoo that we bought at Walmart <laughs> and hot water because they cannot get cold so are you ready to do this? yes! it's gonna be really cute okay so where's the shampoo? I mean it's pretty hot outside anyway so oh 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 oh, I, I... oh Roxy okay oh, oh. <laughs> these are jumpy oh, yeah oh. chaotic because of course they did not like the water and they kept on jumping everywhere like so, little frogs yeah so we had to cut the camera because it got very messy 
But now we're taking, well, not taking them. <laughs> that was so cute. <laughs> we're drying them. And this one's fur is already actually drying up. Yeah. Yeah, we just got them out not long ago. Yeah. But yeah, there's a scientific water. experiment that they don't like water at all. Exactly. Yeah, and also, don't worry, because the uh, shampoo we used, it doesn't, like, irritate the eyes. That's what it said on the label. So that's at least a good thing. Okay, guys. So first of all, before we end this video, I just want to say they smell so good. Like, I don't even think a rat's supposed to smell this <laughs> good. Well, she smells way better than Maisie. Let me smell. Oh, yeah. Probably because I put more. Yeah. But anyways, hopefully we introduce you guys very well because these rats are really good rats. You know, mm -hmm. like people might be thinking, oh, rats, like it's weird, you know. But they're actually really nice pets. <laughs> Where did it go? It's under. It's on my. Because they usually like crawling like on your neck and then going like all the way around. Well, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video as much as I loved it filming it and showing you guys our pet rats. And if you like this video, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up, subscribe down below, and hit that notification button so you won't miss any more video, any video we make. We'll see you guys next time, and you'll see the rats next time sometime too. Yeah. <laughs> Did that make sense? <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Well, anyways, bye!